This review is of Tyson's Slow Cook Kits. Uh, pork roast with vegetables, boneless pork roast, roast contains up to 11% solution of water and salt. It's lovely now how we have to pay for water being added to our meat. I think that should be illegal. Don't you agree? Let me know in the comments. Uh, let's see. So it's family size. It's raised with no added hormones. Uh, USDA inspected. Instructions are right there. And the nutrition facts are there. And of course the ingredients are at the bottom here. Alright. So I need to get this going so that I can eat it before it's time for me to go to sleep. Okay, it says... I don't know if you're supposed to fall out or not. Mm. It doesn't... I don't know if this... I don't think this came frozen, so... I think that the uh, cooking times are going to vary. So I'm going to have to warm up, uh, I'm going to have to do something to uh, deal with that problem. Um, hold on, I'll get back to you in like six hours or so. It's going to pass just like that for you. Alright. Almost forgot to review the pork roast that I, um, and uh, so I cooked it in my, um, slow cooker on hot um, and instead of taking I, I kind of thought it might take six hours um, but it actually took four hours before the meat was done now the meat because pork is sensitive to how long it's cooked you know sometimes um, when I cooked it for four hours uh, when I checked it it was fully cooked at four hours or approximately well maybe it was closer to five hours um, the, um, the potatoes were fully cooked, the onion was fully cooked, the carrots were not quite fully cooked, they were a little bit odd, and that may have been because it had been put in the freezer, um, this, at least that's my assumption. Um, the recipe only calls for a cup of water, and so, um, as it melted water, you know, came out of the meat and um, so there was more than when I had started as far as broth is concerned it is um, for those of you who need to have less salt and stuff like that the salt the seasoning package did not provide very much flavor it was a very it was a very mild flavor um, I'm not really sure what its purpose was, to be quite honest, because it was so mild. I don't know, maybe if I'd cooked it a full six hours, I might have gotten a different experience. But for me, it was pretty mild tasting. Um, we ended up putting some extra salt on it, and that was fine. Um, so I think, you know, if you want something that's a good base, and then you can, you know, add more spices into it to make it more flavorful, if you're good at that kind of thing, which I'm not terribly wonderful at it, um, then this is an excellent choice. I guess I give it a 7. Thank you very much for watching, and I hope you have a great day.